brief application of valves. First one is ball valve. It is used for fully open or fully close. There is no control of pressure or flow rate. Just fully open and fully closed. So this one is the typical use of ball valve as a drain. Below the tank, it's used as a drain. So we can use it for fully open and fully close. When you are doing maintenance, you want to empty the tank, you can use it. So when the lever is in line in the pipe, in the pipeline, in line with the pipeline, that means the valve is open. When the lever is 90 degrees out, away from the pipeline, that means the valve is closed. So this is the ball valve. So used for fully open and fully closed. Now this is gate valve. Gate valve uh, also is similar to ball valve, but there is a ball there inside. Here is a disc, vertical disc, goes up and down. So this one also is, you, you cannot use it for controlling flow, flow rate or pressure. But the difference is it avoids fluid hammer. Fluid hammer, what is fluid hammer? When you open the valve, in, in case of ball valve, you are opening it very fast, like 90 degrees, just rotate 90 degrees, it's fully open. So the liquid rushes and there is a back pressure which will damage the pump. So we use gate valve here. Why we use gate valve? Why it prevents fluid hammer? Because it has hand wheel. So when you open this or close this, it will be gradual process. It will be slow and gradual process. The liquid will be released slowly and you will avoid fluid hammer. So this is the use of gate valve. Gate valve, it is slim because the disc is vertical. It is slim. So ball valve for fully open, fully closed and gate valve to avoid fluid hammer. But still, both of them don't control flow rate and pressure. Now, to control flow rate and pressure, we use globe valve. Globe valve, you can see the G is gone, but this is the globe valve. The body is round and the disc is horizontal and it also has hand wheel to control slow operation of the valve. It can be used for controlling pressure or flow rate and it is, it, uh, it is one directional valve. You see the arrow? So input should be here, output should be here. You cannot flip it opposite. So this is in brief the application of valves.